And we're back with more Faces of Evil. Great! Oh, wonderful. Back here again. Yep. Back in this demented, messed up world. Boat! <laughs> no, wait. No, wait. This isn't boat. This is... This is ship. No, ship. this is... Yeah, this is ship. Boat's grandfather. That's not nearly as funny. It but still it managed still, to get up the mountain. Yeah, it still managed to get up the mountain. <laughs> you're very right about that. But he died on the way. Your sacrifice yeah. will not like, be compare, Like, ship. looking at the ship, take this as a very good comparison to Wind Waker. There's a semblance of something there relating to Zelda game, but when you but when you look at it for more than a second, it is just broken in every single way. I take mm. it you don't like Wind Waker, then. No, 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 no. Uh, this is an insult against this game. Oh, you said Wind Waker. Oh, yeah, because Wind Waker has a ship. <laughs> Wind Waker has a ship. You know, so this wait, might see... be... Well, this so does might... Ocarina of Time if you're counting the uh, ghost ship. And this the might be Temple. the ship. From oh god, that is the butchest little girl I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, we just wait until the cutscene starts. And now it's suddenly a fat Ooh. older girl. Okay, I'm noticing quite a lot of sprite animation dissonance here. And it does have one good joke. Have a heart. <laughs> have a heart. <laughs> yeah, have a heart. heart isn't just isn't a plea for uh, isn't a plea for doing good. It she actually gives you a heart. So it has one joke. good joke. <laughs> one. <laughs> hey, it's better than none. But, I suppose yeah. a stop, even a stop clock is right once a day. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say this. I will say this for the ghost ship area. It's it's very, very short. Yep. You don't need to spend much time here, thank Christ. But, um, but yeah, um, I... Probably should probably should elaborate. I don't actually hate Wind Waker. I really like it. <laughs> I hope I didn't come <laughs> off like that. Uh, like won't I... stop the comments. <laughs> you know how many people we have that comment in the middle of the video. Fair enough. <laughs> Everyone, we all do it. Don't deny it. No, not me. I'm not... being completely sincere. I'll actually wait until the video is over because they might prove my point or prove me wrong at some point of the video. Please, Link. Great, now I'm gonna have a ton of people just complaining at me for hating Wind Waker, even though I don't. <laughs> that guy is like the most uh, uh, dance-tastic uh, prisoner I've ever seen. It's just like, oh, if I'm gonna be chained to a wall, I might as well dance along with the background music. Wow. You know... <laughs> oh, I broke it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That sequence good thing was I an only took two hits. To sword makers. <laughs> actually welded in, but the traditional the, the traditional samurai sword craftsmen of yeah. days long past are rolling in their graves, and the ones who still ho hold the craft up now are just sort of rolling their eyes and being all. Well, you know what? I think they're eternally rolling their eyes because people are really stupid about samurai swords. <laughs> I want man in arms to make that sword. What the CDI sword? The CDI tempered sword. <laughs> and I want to do it in two. They're hits. the guys who made the the the, the falchion from Fire Emblem Awakening, right? Yeah, the, they the, make the they, tempered basically sword. They make a lot is, of just, stuff. It's just, just a cartoon sword with a with a stamp painted on. <laughs> yeah, I know. I want it, man in arms. It, to make it's it. like something Bugs Bunny like would come years. up with if he wanted to fool an alien into thinking he had a legendary sword. Well, he also had Mike's secret stuff. <sighs> what? Again with the, the, the again with the starting hey, you out underneath hey guys, falling hey guys, pebbles. Guess what? Guess what we get to do? It's time right. to bomb some oh, Dodongos. <laughs> <sighs> no, it's great. Wrong, wrong game, John. Oh. I do want to point out the Moblins. These are Moblins, right? Wait. The Moblins and Ganon himself, they're supposed yep. to look piggish, yeah. aren't they? But they come out looking more like pit bulls. Or um, yeah, maybe pugs. Bulldogs. I'm sorry, I, I'm mixing up really look bulldogs like with pit bulls game. again. I always do that. Pit bulls are cute. I like pit bulls. Well, this guy's just having a jolly good time. <laughs> <laughs> All you need is a 
mug of It's alcohol. literally all he has in this house. And a seat to sit his ass on while he enjoys them. <laughs> oh, so no, he's no, sort of he's, dark he's, message he's perfected here. the art of Zen. He doesn't need anything else in his life. He just needs his Where Zen. Are you hiding, partner? I'm going to fight Blutko. Don't fight him, feed him. Mm, something spicy. Know what I mean? I'm gonna tell you how to beat the boss. <laughs> yep. Pretty much, and somehow he has well. Hey, maybe they want some of that eternally regenerating beer and uh, drumsticks. Actually, he's not even drinking the beer; he's just eating he's the drumsticks. Just eating. He's, How did he get yeah, drunk? Yeah, the drumstick is what's gener regenerating. How did he get drunk if he hadn't ever? Drumsticks are beer? actually alcoholic in this game. <laughs> huh? That make beer food? Yeah, beer. Food. Well, beer is. Oh, we got beer nuts. Why not yeah. beer drumsticks? So if drumsticks are actually alcohol, it, it, it's make possible. My odd, uh, choices after well, well, here. beer is sometimes used in, in batter, but um, it is possible they overdid it with that particular bowl of fried chicken. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the eye of I can see that. Of yeah. I can't believe we actually justified that. I'm simply famished. This guy has tits on his chest. <laughs> Wonderful. The only piece of comic relief in the entire 47 Ronin's movie. <sighs> no, no, not yet. I have heard much about it, though. I hear Keanu Reeves is actually pretty good in it, considering. I just don't get why Hollywood put so much money into a Japanese history film. It was probably just something Keanu... Well, I don't know. It's I, something Keanu yeah. wanted to do. Yeah. Yeah, he's he's he's, he's a big Eastern kind of Mongo taco person. He's a weeaboo? Keanu Reeves is a weeaboo? <laughs> Not quite a weeaboo, no. but he is interested in that stuff. <laughs> Famous last words. Uh, I didn't know that. I thought it was just Hollywood being silly. Okay. No. Well, it, it's why he wanted to do the Cowboy Bebop to uh, begin with, because he's a fan of the series. Did you see, when I saw that movie, no, my first thought much, no. was, they're making a samurai movie because samurai are cool, but they're casting a white guy as the, as, as the lead because Hollywood doesn't like Japanese people. <laughs> Guess... The last, the last samurai starring Tom Cruise. Oh, okay. yeah, that that one's arguably worse. Because <laughs> that's oh, trying to be a bit more Ronin historical is... than Forty Seven Ronin. Yeah, yeah <laughs> Demon Ronin and has all like that, dragons. But the Forty Seven Ronin yeah. part is yeah. historically accurate, at least. And yeah. it's, it's kind of it's kind of like Oni Musha, except it sucks. Legends and stuff. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, I guess it's just one of the one of those things. Like, we'll just use history as a backdrop to make something interesting. Except, well, I think well, I think the Forty Seven Ronin thing is actually like a like it has some more mystical elements in the original. I'm not sure. I'm not an expert on any of this stuff. But I think like some of the other tellings Man, do have. There's always a mystical telling of anything in in like no. Japanese history, pretty much. Uh, didn't we just blow this guy up? I well, think we'll really blow it again. Of... That one didn't think it was delicious. At least it. Uh, it's a good <laughs> thing this game is ready to eat a K to A. It's a good thing it didn't blow up Corridon when we exploded him. Yeah, why does he have the book of Corridon That's just, on him? Considering. Considering. I don't know. Cons oh. 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 But, you know, considering again. it's the item that you beat the final boss with, it's kind of fucking a random placement for it. I mean, you'd think there would be a bit more fanfare about the task of getting it, but no, it's just a random boss drop. The developers at this point in, at this point in the game were pretty much threw up their hands and said, fuck it. Yeah, it's about as exciting as finding a book. Well, finding a magical out, book basically. can be pretty exciting. The See the Tantarian. Not if you're in a Call of Cthulhu campaign. You find a magical book, you just don't want to look at it. In fact, if you're playing a Call of Cthulhu game and you don't want to die, just ignore the plot. Go home. Well, yeah. it's Cthulhu. Well, it's the only course. way to not die, yeah. <laughs> Why would you ever?
Well, because it's interesting. I mean, it's like you find you want to learn more about Cthulhu. It's just so don't read H.P. Cthulhu, Lovecraft. So okay. Oh no! You should so read spread HP it out so that uh, so that it doesn't notice you as you're reading it. Oh no! You 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 go insane uh, the more yeah, stuff you right, well, learn. Yeah, Well, if you again, if you uh, wait, why did I get that? Well, get stuff? someone else to uh, do all the plot stuff the story for you. Here, folks. <laughs> Listen, such is the power uh, okay, okay. of the prince Ghost of the darkness oh, yeah, I see. that he can kill with a single look. Attacks against Ganon will prove fruitless unless Link okay. attacks with the sacred book. Yeah, throw the book at him. And he means that literally. Yeah. Yeah, he, yeah you literally <laughs> throw the book at him. Guys, steal my puns, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting until we actually killed Ganon. <sighs> damn it, guys. Oh, never anticipate a pun, Ted. Yeah. Oh, I know, yeah. I had that one prepared. No, but uh, what, what if you fuck up the, the delivery? All that waiting for nothing. I like to assume that I'm at least going to do a semi-decent job. You will obey. It does look like a bulldog. Even in the animation, it looks like a bulldog. I mean, it's pink like a pig, but it still looks like a bulldog. So it's just a hairless yeah. bulldog. And then we go back to the NES games where... I think, um, I, I think it's just, uh... Yeah, I, I think they didn't start looking like pigs until, uh... No, because I didn't get pig. No, I think Ganon the was the only one who looked like a pig. Pig, yeah, because Zelda and the uh, uh, NES Zelda, okay. they still look like bulldogs. Yeah, like uh, Ganon, on the other hand, looked like Porky the Pig on steroids. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, they still keep his piggish look in the later games, but he's a bit more credible. Yeah, it's but like it, it changes based of on time, the time. If you look at his, his uh, at Ganon's final form, he does have a pig snout. And then in Twilight yeah. Twilight yeah, Princess, I, he turns into a giant boar. That's probably why they go to such great great lengths to kind of shadow it over. No, I, I think even with uh, the, yeah. the design yeah, of Ganon, I'll, Ocarina of Time was still badass enough. You know. Yeah. yeah, it's a it's a pig. Yeah, well, but it, yeah it's yeah, a pig. Well, have but it's you a pig ever seen? Have you, you ever like yeah. seen like a warthog in action? Uh, besides the ones in Hannibal that messed well, up I that saw one, one guy. Yeah, he doesn't count. Like an actual warthog will fuck you up. Don't do it. Okay, let's see. Oh, our congr Those congratulations! Those things look like Darth first Vader. Lull. Okay. Seriously. Um, what is this? Is what is this? What are we? What is this? Is this a cave or is it a tower? <laughs> Lewis, I'm surprised. No, I mean this six, specific area. What is this? <laughs> I don't get it. It's oh, a cave and a I can't decide if this. If, I can't. I can't figure out if this area is trying to be yeah, natural I... or man-made. Funny. Yes. yes. How long is the lantern supposed to last anyway? All right, let's count now. I've never counted. One, two, three, four, five, six, In your head, seven. Please. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Okay, you can stop seventeen, now. The eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. Oh, well, it lasts what? more than twenty-five seconds. 20... Oh yeah. I... Wait, does it does it does it carry over when you die? Stop counting. We uh, don't know. It, yeah, it does carry over. Oh, it does carry over. Ah, well, so you lost count. I think. Yes. I think. I don't remember I think if it actually might carries over or, or if seconds. it resets. It uh -huh. It does last for a while, which is why well, I'm counted. Well, the, the, you have the super lantern at this point. The original. Well, what that does is like basically that. instead of it being a normal lantern um, where you, don't you have, have to, to buy use it. Uh, 
lamp oil to use it. You pretty much uh, with the magic lantern, which you got from you the you can just uh, turn it on and off. Guy, and you don't have to. Um, okay, that's handy. Yeah, you don't actually use any lamp oil. At that which, point, though. At that point, though, why? I don't know why they had. You, well, sorry. I don't know why they didn't have at you that, use uh, just no lamp oil to begin with. I mean, at that the point, why have a lantern at all? I spy with my eyes. So this is the first game, Zelda die. game to have a. No, wait, a Link to the Past. Though. Link to the Past had a lantern, but that was magic powered. Yeah, you sit. You, 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 you just are sit, clearly you're blocking, blocking it with, that your rock with your face. <laughs> Yep, to beat this guy, uh, you your sit there and do nothing. Death animation seems to go... Uh, oh, he dissolved like a final... No, no. <laughs> the bosses dissolve into red. It's a real fancy name for glasses. Chris, what do you think the prescription on the Crystal of Vision is? <laughs> oh, <laughs> this track. I love this Something track. Something to do with magic. What, do you just spend your <laughs> no, time no, to just this people? specific track. I think it came up in the AVGN review. It's like uh, yeah, every everyone yeah, uses it's this just track the, the, this one track is just particularly well known. It, it's just really rocking. <laughs> I can I can head bop to this. <laughs> I just like it. God damn it! Leave me alone. <laughs> I swear, somebody just took their bass guitar and had a wonderful maybe Saturday a, night, and this soundtrack was born. Hey, maybe it's that three member <laughs> you know, band you guys were talking about earlier doing this. Feces made this. <laughs> but you know what? You know, you know what's better about no, this feces though? Feces is the rest of the game. You not only can you head bop to it, but it fits the enemy animation struts and Link's animation strut. It might even fit a Belmont strut. It's just music you can strut to. <laughs> At last, you have the vision to find my house. Now you will see the what? Kumis that prevent your approach to Ganon. Go with many blessings. What? So wait, <laughs> the, the sand things are going with many blessings? Oh, why, um, why are you... <laughs> What happens is basically when you, uh, if you try to go to Ganon's lair without the, uh, without the, uh, what's it, without the lantern, which the glass, replaces the your magic glass. lantern, by the way. Um, what ends up happening is there's a bunch of flying enemies that you, uh, go uh... And you can't actually see. Like, yeah, so you but... can still hit them, but you just flat out can't see them. So would it be possible to beat the game before it? <laughs> yeah. You would still need the Book of Cord, I know. Yeah. yeah, at that point, uh... you might as well just go. That sounds like uh, a lot of those, though, that, that the, the invisible enemies you uh, ran into in the old Casuto village in Zelda 2 that you needed the uh, cross to see. Hmm. Yeah.